You're watching WAFB 9 News at 10. Hello, we have some exciting news today. A man born in Baton Rouge is being honored for his successful career in the ministry. He's celebrating, let's see, 35 years of pastoring Macedonia Missionary Baptist Church and 31 years at Greater St. Luke Baptist Church. And there are unconfirmed reports, we understand. He does not understand the concept of vacations, just taking time off. Well, as local sources tell Nine News, he was a sports star years ago before he entered the ministry. And for that angle of the story, WAFB sports anchor Steve Schneider is here. Donna, this man's a machine. He's like the energi <laughs> Energizer buddy. He won't stop. Been 50 years since a local kid from the part of town called Boulevard Bottom played many sports from football as McKinley's quarterback to basketball for the Black Organized League as a point guard. But the sport this young man, David Newman, dominated was softball. A pitcher for the Mount Zion Crusaders, he was a teammate with local minister and civil rights activist, the Reverend T.J. Jemison, his shortstop. And when David Newman was on that mound, batters knew they were in trouble. Newman pitched many no-hitters, struck out most of the so-called top hitters. He was especially known for throwing that famous curveball. And for that, we want to say thanks for the wonderful years of memories and wish you and your family and church families the best life has to offer. And thanks for the concern that you've shown, the dedication and the time you've given to your churches and to your community. It's certainly an honor and a pleasure for me to be able to be on this program today via video and audio tape for my dear friend, Reverend David Newman. Reverend David Newman is a true man of God. I've been knowing him for many, many years. In fact, I was a bad boy when Reverend Newman was playing softball for Mount Zion, and I was with Chicken Shack. Only thing I regret is the big mistake we made is when we tried to recruit him, and I thought that we did, but maybe we didn't, because he was great. Best fastball pitcher in softball that we ever had. Used to have the, the uh, old Pike Burden lot on the corner of Terrace and Holland Road packed every time the Chicken Shack and Mount Zion would play. Reverend Newman has done so much at St. Luke and Macedonia Church and throughout this community where he has made many contributions to government and to other persons who are very much trying to find God and he helped them. Thank you so much for being my friend. I just appreciate you so much. My family and I thank you so much for what you've done for us. God bless you and keep you. Thank you.
When Reverend Newman mounts the pulpit, he preaches and gives it his all every time. Well, I'm ashamed of the gospel of Thomas. His most requested sermon is Dry Bones in the Valley. Another young preacher saw me uh, later on during that week. He said, Ray, you know, so you only go to the bank in the t-shirt. People don't know, don't know you're a preacher. So uh, next time I saw him, I had a necktie. And uh, he said, that's how you look. I said, but the first time you saw him, I went to deposit money. The last time I went to borrow something. <laughs> 